Hey guys, Light Blade Absol here. And well I just wanted to say this this has been something that's been going on on the channel for quite a while now. And it's the debate over Funtime Foxy's gender. Now, as as I'm pretty sure you all know, I had to shut down the comments on one of my videos, which, unfortunately, because of the huge disrespect I was getting on it. And I gotta find it real quick. Uh, this one. Yeah, every nobody was reading the description about the fact that this was a head cannon. Keyword there: head cannon. Not it's not cannon to the actual. It's not cannon to the actual series. So, I had to shut that down, unfortunately, because nobody was reading the description or paying attention. And really, it was actually one comment that really set me off. Um, yeah, they were really disrespectful. And now I'm getting even more comments on my other videos. Um, I think more on, I believe, the couple themes here about the gender as well. I gotta find that comment, though. The particular comment. Well, actually, I know an easier way to find it. Over to community. Get right in here. Let's see. Yeah, I believe in this whole chain here. I can't find that exact comment, but somebody in this little chain here said that on Scott's website, he confirmed Funtime Foxy's gender. Now, as far as I know, Scott only has one website, that is Scott Games. And if we go on to it, this see he's talking about the custom nice gun comes soon, which I'm excited to see Markiplier play that. And then information, unlike on his actual Twitter, his actual Tumblr, his Twitch, his YouTube, his Reddit, all his different accounts, He's only, he should only trust his website, which is this one, and his Steam pages. And if you have any questions, his email right there. Now, where on here do I, did you get that Funtime Foxy was confirmed to be female? Because I don't see it. I don't see it. I, I see... Bonnie puppet here with bitty, a bitty bath, but that's it. I don't, I don't see it. I don't see how you could, how Scott could possibly say in, in all this. Don't even think it would be in the, uh, 
the, the uh, even if you go through and look at the script for the page, I don't think it would say it in there. So guys, please, just because it looks like Mangle doesn't necessarily mean it has to be the same gender as Mangle. And yes, I know I'm trying to prove a point with, like, probably now 99% of the fan base that had canon this, the head canon, Funtime Foxy as female, but it's, there is no confirmed gender. Stop getting all butt hurt over the fat, over someone else's head canon being male. There's a reason why I head canon mine differently, even though I still give Funtime Foxy a male voice. He uses it, he likes to be referred to as she. So that way I cover both sides of that. If this is, re uh, you guys don't understand, this is really why I'm debating on whether or not I'm leaving the fandom. I mean, I'll still watch playthroughs and all that. I just won't draw fan art anymore. And I have a really good... I really like my style of drawing them, and I want to continue drawing them. But if I'm going to keep getting criticized over everybody else's head cannons being the opposite of mine, and there being fights down in the comments, I'm going to have to stop. And yes, if I leave the channel, that means I disable the comments on every single FNAF video I put up. Even if there isn't a problem in them. So guys, please stop fighting. It's just a simple headcanon. There's no specified gender. If you can't deal with the fact that I headcanon something differently than you, then don't leave a comment, just leave. There's no need to be hateful for no reason. Anyways, I just wanted to get that out. I hope... Uh, anyways, I hope you guys have a wonderful Thanksgiving tomorrow. And I'll see you all later. Bye!